Hi, I'm Daisy, and today, because it's Halloween, we're going to be making some spooky pumpkins. You will need something to draw with, something to color with, and something to draw on. We're going to start with our center pumpkin. So we're going to draw two lines curving in the same direction, where the bottom is wider, and it's narrower at the top. And then you can, can connect it with a circle at the top of the stem. And then you can draw some jagged lines to connect it on the bottom. And then since these are spooky pumpkins, you can draw them all sorts of wacky shapes. They don't have to be round pumpkins or perfectly shaped pumpkins. So for mine, I'm going to start about one third of the way up the stem and draw some wacky lines. Just like that. Now on the right, I'm going to do the same thing, draw a stem, except this time I'm going to make the stem curve in the opposite direction. So wider at the bottom, skinnier at the top, connect with the circle, jagged lines. Then I'm going to make this one a little bit different. So I'm going to draw a line coming out from the stem, curving. Just draw some more curvy lines like that. And I'm making them sort of close together so that it looks like they were, you know, when you see like pumpkins, they're like arranged together. So I'm drawing them pretty close together. And now on the left side, I'm gonna draw a little pumpkin. So I'm gonna draw the stem, a little stem, connect it with a circle. Bottom, I'm gonna connect it with jagged lines. And then one third the way up our pumpkin so now i think this is the fun part because you can create any face that you want in these pumpkins so i'm going to start by doing my face on this one spooky eyes and a smile and then on my second one i'm going to draw a ghost face so i'm going to draw two circles for the eyes and then a spooky ghost mouth. And you can draw your pumpkins however you want. You can do different designs for the shape of them, and then you can also do different faces. Or if you want, you can do the same as me. And then for my little pumpkin, I'm gonna draw two little eyes with a jagged mouth. This is probably what most of you imagine for jack-o'-lanterns with the type of mouth. And now I'm done drawing my these spooky pumpkins, but they don't look quite finished yet. We have to color first. 